a blur, but talk me through the timeline, if you can even remember what's happened when, at what point. Yeah, I mean, Gunther called me about a week ago or something like that and uh, asked me if I would be interested. And, you know, we, we talked about things and, uh, you know, I, I pretty pretty quickly said, yes, I'm interested, you know, let's, let's, uh, let's look at this, see if we can do it. And then, you know, a couple of days passed and he was sorting some things out and, you know, then uh, he, he came back and said, okay, let's, uh, let's go for it. So then I had a couple of things I needed to sort it out and, you know, uh, it only happened all in like three, three days and uh, it's pretty crazy. When I was on the plane coming here, uh, I didn't actually even know if it was fully going to happen. So, yeah, it was crazy. Uh, signed the contract yesterday and now, you know, it's all done. I'm, I'm back in Formula One. <laughs> you certainly are, and it looked like you were having the best time catching up with people. I saw a lovely video of you meeting back up with the mechanics and engineers. Um, what have they told you about what to expect? Because I'm sure it's all fun they, and games now. They don't, but a bit you know, it's not like they tell me what to expect, but they, you know, I can clearly feel that they're more optimistic than they've been in the last couple of years that I've been with the team. So that's that's a good feeling. Um, you know, there's there's a lot of smiles and jokes and uh, you know just have a, have a good feeling so I don't know anything about this car <laughs> it's the first time I see it today and I haven't been part of the development of it but you know uh, I have I have a positive feeling that it's gonna be a fun fun year and it's gonna be hard work I guess but that's what you enjoy because you'll be helping with the setup tweaking a few things here and there you're ready for that to be working yeah full know, I'm tilt. looking forward to just getting getting to know the car there's a lot of new systems new suspensions and stuff that I haven't, uh, that I don't know on this car, so uh, that's what I'll spend some time doing uh, this week and next, um, and then we have a race next week, so yes, yeah, it's fun, it's crazy. Have you, do you still fit the seat, or have you had to have a new seat fit? No, it's funny, I had I had the same seat, since the first seat I did at, at Haas was the, was the seat I used all the way to the end, so unfortunately that doesn't fit in this car, so I had to make a new one, but... Uh, yeah, it's uh, it feels good, ready to go. Awesome, and then of course your new teammate Mick. Have you had a bit of a chat? I guess quite busy time for everybody at the moment. Very busy. He's been busy too, but uh, you know I'm, I met him at the end of 2020. He came to Abu Dhabi um, just to to watch and and you know be with the team and stuff, and had a bit of time with him there. And he's a super cool cool guy, and uh, you know he's a Formula Two uh, champion, and you know. Uh, obviously grew up in with racing in his blood and you know I, I know what that means and and I think you know it's gonna be really exciting to uh, to get to know him a bit better and certainly he's a very big talent that um, you know is exciting to watch and just finally I haven't been watching because I've been waiting to talk to you um, is the car out and about on track yet? should be should be in, in the afternoon session yeah so now it should be all okay and everything's fine everything was in the box that was unpacked well we were walking down here when they were driving out so uh, I hope so <laughs> perfect oh well great to see you back and can't wait Thank to see what you. we can do this year